15 largest retailers in the US closing their doors right now. Welcome to the channel where we bring you the latest updates and trends in the retail industry. In today's video, we have some breaking news that has left the retail industry in shock. We are going to take a look at the 15 largest retailers in the US that are closing their doors right now. It's a sad reality that some of our favorite stores are shutting down, so let's dive in and see who's on the list. 1. The List of Retailers Number 15, starting off the list, we have a popular clothing retailer that's been around for decades. They have announced they will be closing over 200 stores in the US. Number 14, the next retailer on our list is one that's been around for almost 100 years. They have been struggling for a while, and unfortunately, they've decided to close all their stores. Number 13, moving on, we have a famous department store that has been around for over 150 years. It's sad to say that they've announced they will be closing down all their stores in the US. Number 12, next on the list, we have a store that's been around for almost 100 years, and they've announced they will be closing over 100 stores across the US. Number 11, another popular department store has made it onto the list. They have been around for over 100 years, but unfortunately, they flopped. Number 10, moving on, we have a well-known shoe retailer that has been struggling in recent years. They have announced they will be closing over 500 stores across the US. Number 9, next on the list is a retailer that has been around for over 50 years, but unfortunately, they've announced they will be closing all their stores in the US. Number 8, another clothing retailer has made it onto the list. They have been struggling for a while and have decided to close over 100 stores across the US. Number 7, next up, we have a famous toy retailer that has been around for almost 75 years. They have announced they will be closing all their stores in the US. Number 6, moving on, we have a popular jewelry store that has been around for over 100 years. They have announced they will be closing over 150 stores across the US. Number 5, next on the list, we have a well-known electronics retailer that has been struggling in recent years. They have announced they will be closing over 300 stores across the US. Number 4, another department store has made it onto the list. They have been around for over 100 years, but unfortunately, they've decided to close over 30 stores in the US. Number 3, moving on, we have a retailer that has been around for almost 100 years. They have announced they will be closing all their stores in the US. Number 2, next up, we have a popular bookstore that has been around for over 50 years. They have announced they will be closing all their stores in the US. Number 1, and finally, the number one retailer on our list is a popular home goods store that has been around for almost 100 years. They have announced they will be closing over 200 stores across the US. Reasons behind the closures Now that we've seen the list of retailers that are closing their doors, let's take a look at some of the reasons behind the closures. Many of these retailers have been struggling for years due to the rise of e-commerce and changing consumer preferences. The COVID-19 pandemic has also had a major impact on the retail industry, with many stores experiencing a significant decline in sales. What this means for the industry The closure of these major retailers is a major blow to the retail industry. It's a sign of the changing times and the need for retailers to adapt to the new landscape. It also means that there will be fewer job opportunities in the industry, and many communities will be impacted by the closures. That's all for today's video on the 15 largest retailers in the US closing their doors right now. It's a sad reality that some of our favorite stores are shutting down, but it's important to remember that the retail industry is constantly evolving. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more updates on the retail industry.